Louise completed a class and asked as a complete newbie what to do to get work. So how do you get work as a digital artist? Right now it's about quantity over quality. You need to get in the habit of creating and publishing work consistently. You need to get the reps in. Like an athlete, you can't be an athlete that doesn't you can't be a digital artist that doesn't create art. And this is something I wish I'd done sooner. I spent way too long on an image and I was way too focused on creating the very best image possible. And really, this is what they teach at school, college and uni, where we'd spend whole terms on just a couple of images. And granted, a couple of nice looking images will help your career. But if you want to get work, you got to put in the reps. I recently read this article where a teacher divided the class into two. And the teacher said that the first group would be graded on the quality of their best pot. And the second group would be graded on the quantity of the pots they produced. So here's a quote. The Students in the second group were no longer handicapped by the fear of failure. They made mistakes, iterated, and developed their creativity and intuition. In time, their confidence also grew. Soon enough, they could produce vastly diverse and sophisticated pots with ease. James Clear also says, start with repetitions and not gold. So the number one thing to do as a digital artist is create, create, create. And just remember, we're not creating to create better images. We're trying to make better abilities, skills, and techniques. So don't just focus on the results, also focus on the day-to-day -day grind and the consistency schedule time for it and a method that's worked really well for me is called don't break the chain the idea is to put a calendar on your wall in a really prominent place and every day that you create something you can put an x on the calendar after a few days you're going to have this chain and each day that chain is going to keep getting longer this is pretty motivating all you have to do is not break the chain it sounds easy because it is and it works if you wanted to be able to juggle you wouldn't just buy a book on juggling read it and then expect to be able to juggle you learn to juggle by juggling practicing failing try again and it's the same principle for your art you create better images by creating images so go and create some images publish them and then do it again and then do it again and then do it again